Yo. Okay. Okay. For real? Hmm? Yeah. up <laughs> yo place even take us anywhere? Yeah. Should lead us straight to our building. Careful. Hello. Never know what kind of lunatics you'll run into. Cool. Get alive. Come on now. Check this out. Let's go. You're in it now. You 
wanna go? I'm up! I got it. The enemy is defeated! You're going down. Yeah. Come on now. Check this out. Okay. Let's go. Huh? Going in.
think you're doing here? Wake up! We got intruders! Get them! Come on! Yeah! Come Take on your now! Best Check this out! Let's go! Chinese restaurant here. Where the hell it go? Ah, quit jabbering and get your ass upstairs. Huh? Who the fuck are you? The battle is on. Yeah. Come on now. Check this out. Okay. I'm up. You're in it now! Come on! 
on now. Check this now, right? Let's go. You're in it now. Yeah, I don't know, right? I'm up! I got this! Going in! What's up? Oh, I got this! Got it! Get it! Get a light! Oh, come on now! Check this out! Ready to die, punk? Oh, come up the hill there. The battle is on. Cool. Check this out.
pretty good. Captain Sawashiro. Oh, Ichi. It's been a while. When'd you get out? Come on. I know you don't care when I got out. <laughs> Sounds like prison made you into a pessimist. You should have called us. We would have sent someone to pick you up. I wouldn't have wanted a ride from anyone wearing an Omi badge. Where were you when the boss turned traitor? Watch your tongue, Ichi. He only did what anyone else would have done in times like these. But you're right. Even if the Tojo clan still existed, no one would have come to pick you up. You do realize that, right? Because if you remember, you were banished from the clan. Look, I'm not actually that hung up about the ride. And yeah, I remember the banishment. So what do you want? Did you come to beg for money? You know, I thought you might be grateful. Did you forget who spent 18 years eating prison slop in your place? Oh, I'm very aware of what you did. But you're not aware of what's happening tonight. What? It's a very important event for the boss. I can't risk one of his former grunts ruining it. So the choice is yours. Leave like a good boy, or die here. I'm going through that door, and talking to my boss. <laughs> you know, I really forgot how seeing your stupid face always made me want to kill you. I thought the same thing about you. Every time you hit me for no reason. Well, it's been 18 long years. About time one of our dreams came true. Sounds good. Just don't bitch and moan about it afterwards. You ready, EJ? Let's do it! Yeah! Check this out! Showed up. I've been waiting a long time for this. You're in it now. Is that all you've got? Yeah. Check this out. Come on. Now. Cool. You gonna try? Check this out. Captain's got that freakish aura around him, and he's in a fighting stance. Gotta be careful. Yeah. I'll go on the defensive and see what he does. Hey, it worked! Cool. 
what you're doing once you go through that door there's no turning back Ichi are you sure you're ready for that 18 years I've been waiting to open this goddamn door for 18 years that's long enough <laughs> this be? Pardon the interruption. It seems I have a guest. So, you came. I figured you would. You never disappoint. <laughs> Boss, please just tell me. Why'd you do it? Captain, do we have a problem here? No, nothing serious. No need for you to worry. Boss. In fact, it's going as planned. <gasps> I'm sorry, Ichi. You have to die.
morning, sunshine. You might not have dodged a bullet, but you dodged Wednesday. Wednesday is when they pick up the food garbage. Your ass would have been composted. Your wound's not completely healed, but the fact that you're standing means you'll be just fine. Time to go on home. Go home. Somebody's probably worried about you. Don't you have a family, wife, kids? By the way, you'll have to take the stitches out by yourself when it's healed. Hey, listen. Hey, did that guy ever die? He died, right? Nah, he's alive. Hey! Oh man, I lost the bet. I'll have to pay you later. I don't got no money right now. Big surprise. Those are some damn tight stitches you did with that fishing line. You really were a nurse, huh? Well, if he hadn't been a fighter, no amount of stitches would have saved him. Man, couldn't he have thrown that fight? Hey, you know how much money I lost on you? Next time, just kick the bucket. What was that? Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, being that it's your fault and all, I'm just wondering if you could cover my bet for me. I'll give it a rest. Check it out, I got some big ones at the dock today. You want one, you sore loser? Ooh! You're really willing to share these buttes? I'm not sure, but I'm open to a fair trade. I need gas. Find me a big can of that, and we'll give you a fish. Aw, oh, seriously? I knew there'd be a catch. I'll find you some gas. So you better save me a big one. <laughs> a big one. Hey, man. Huh? What do you want? I've got so many questions. Where do I even start? Uh, first of all, where the hell are we? This is Eugene Cho. Eugene Cho? Eugene Cho. Isazaki Eugene Cho. In Yokohama. Don't you know Yokohama? <sighs> Yokohama? Why am I in Yokohama? <sighs> Hell if I know. It's been three days since I found you. I got woken up by a commotion in the middle of the night. And I saw them carry you in, covered in blood. They said they found you in the trash. I thought you were dead at first. But lucky for you, turned out you only had one foot in the grave. And you've been what? Nursing me back to health? As best I can. But as you can see, I can't do any real treatment here. There are only two reasons you survived. You're tough as nails, and you're lucky as hell. The bullet missed your heart, your arteries, and then went clean out the back. One hair to the left, and you would have been a goner. Damn. Well, thank you, man. It sounds like you saved my life. You're making it sound more noble than it is. What? It only helped because if you died here, it would have meant trouble. What trouble? Where there's a dead body, there's cops. And where there are cops, there are questions. So what? Well, then the media comes charging in, cameras and microphones all up in our faces. I guess so. So don't you see? Or are you as dumb as you look? We're not exactly supposed to be living here. I don't like using the term, but we're squatters, basically. Whoa. Plus, everyone's got their reasons for being here. They came here to escape something. You attract media coverage, that blows their hiding place. You get it now? Yeah. I get it. Good. Now go home. Home? I'm sorry, Ichi. I don't exactly have one. Huh? Listen, I promise I won't make trouble for anyone here. So, do you think you could let me stay for a bit? No can do. Please, I'll make it worth your while. Help you out. Help me? <laughs> you think we help each other out like some big, happy family? We live by taking from others. Leeches. That's our world. 
It's a world where dozens of us crowd around a convenience store trying to claim half as many expired bentos. If you stay, someone else gets less to eat. You don't want that, we don't want that. Get out of here. <sighs> Fine. <sighs> Guess I should have expected that. Your wound isn't healed all the way, and you haven't walked for three days. It's no wonder you're weak. Guess you'll have to rest here for a bit. A little bit. Thanks. Under all that hard-ass talk, you're actually a decent guy. No, I'm not. I just don't want the shit that'll come down on us if someone dies here. Yeah, yeah. But still, I owe you one. <sighs> well... Can't argue with you there. So, where do we start? Where do we start with what? I'm not just gonna hang around here fussing over you. And since you're staying, you gotta do what I say. Okay, sure. What's your name? Ichiban. Ichiban Kaska. Huh. That's pretty paranoid of you using a fake name. And again, you wouldn't be the first guy living here to do that. You got a shit feel for names, though. Fake ones gotta be more like... <sighs> That's my real name, man. Oh. Oh, really? Um... Uh, sorry about that. Ichiban. <laughs> Don't wear it out. And you are? Nanba. N-A-N-B-A. <laughs> Let me guess. Fake name? What do you think? I think it's all the same to me. Good. Because it doesn't matter here anyway. You got any money on you? I hope you're not broke. Uh, you're about to be disappointed then. <sighs> well, in that case, you're gonna have to start earning. I'll teach you how. Why do I need money all of a sudden? Are you kidding me? Actually, I just remembered you'll have to get the Chief's permission to stay. The chief? He's been here a long time. Sort of maintains the peace. Sorry if I gave you the impression it was all up to me. Uh, you gotta get his okay. And your best chance of doing that is to show you can earn. Sounds more like a bribe if you ask me. Call it whatever you want. You need it. The chief doesn't accept freeloaders. If you don't work, or if you're a liar or a cheat, you're out. So if you want his blessing, you have to work your butt off, make some money, and prove you really want to be here. Got it? I get it. But you never said how I should make the money. I'll get you going. Luckily, we've got some daylight left. All right, here we go. Here we go where? I said I'd teach you how to make money, didn't I? Watch closely. This is how we do it. <laughs> this is what you do for money? Kinda lame. We can't afford to worry about looking lame, man. Having pride around here is a sure way to starve to death. Wait, I think I found a 500 yen coin. Oh, that fast? Oh yeah, it's my lucky day. up just to have them crushed. All right, now it's your turn. Go check underneath the other vending machines. Trash cans too. Sometimes people throw away stuff that we can sell. I'm on it. Cool. I'm gonna head back to camp. Come find me when you're done. And don't wander far. There are a lot of dangerous dudes in this town. All right then. Good luck, rookie.
Mm-hmm. <laughs>